welcome back to another Beauty Bang Bang review and this is a four piece feather themed stamping starter kit. So before I start stamping I'm going to paint my nails and I'm using this gel polish number 1441 which is a gray color. So I'm painting half of the nail with this gel polish and I'm feathering it towards the center of the nail because I want it to blend in with the other polish I'm going to use. The next gel polish color I'm using is White Queen and this is from Model Once and it's a shimmery iridescent glitter topper and I just wanted it to sparkle on its own so that's why I left the tip, the base clear. So in this stamper set, it comes with four pieces. This is the skew number for the first piece, which is a stamper head. It's the clear rectangle stamper head, and this one is my favorite from Beauty Big Bang. I love to stamp with this because you can see where you're stamping, and it comes with a scraper, which has like little holiday themes around there. Also in this kit comes a stamping polish, and the color I got is blue which is the blue metallic and there's an expiration date on the box which I didn't know that but it's good to know and these are all the cautions and ingredients in this polish and this is the skew number it will be listed down below if you guys are interested I believe they sell it separately and like I said this is a blue metallic color and the stamping plate is Beauty Big Bang XL 065 which is a feather theme after I remove blue films off my stamping plates I like it I like to give it a good um, swipe with regular nail polish remover and a lint free wipe and here's a closer look at the plate. It has all these beautiful different types of feathers. So let's get started. So first you add the polish onto the design you want to use. Then you get your scraper card and scrape it at a 45 degree angle. Try to scrape it one or two times, not too much because the polish will dry out and the snapper will not pick it up. So here is the first image. I use a lint roller to remove the unwanted designs I don't want to transfer onto the nail. So once you're done doing that, it's time to stamp it on the nail. So the good thing about this little stamper is you can see exactly where you want to put the image. So you press it down firmly, make sure you get the sides, you rock it from side to side, and then you pat down the polish if there's some little flyaways, and there it goes. So I will leave you with this video so you guys can enjoy all the different images on this plate that I'm going to be stamping on the nails. I saw this beautiful peacock on the plate and I just knew I had to stamp it on the nails so let's see how it looks and here is a closer look at all of the other images on the stamping plate that I didn't get to swatch on a nail and here are all the nails already top coated. That blue metallic stamping polish looks so beautiful on top of these colors. I really love how it uh, pops out. So if you guys are interested in this starter kit, link will be down below. And don't forget to use any of my discount codes if you want to, to save some coins, you know. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.